abangazange beve nokuva ukuba kukho umoya oyincwele nasi ke isaziso sa kukuba yonke nyinto sakhe sibe ke phansi ke sazise umoya oyincwele nakulo ebesele mas Ngoba ukukhonza kunzima umoyo ingwele ngeko. Ukukhonza ngumsebenzi onzima. Ozi sebenzi lango kwako umoyo ingwele ngeko. Amen. E, ezi zinto zonke zinkulu zitetwa yo up. Impumele amanda azo akumoya oingwele. Ukusala kukati kongo kubuchebi. Amanda ukusala kukati kongo kusala ngomoya oingwele. Amen. Izenzo zokusebenza imisebenzi kati isekenzwa ngomoya oingwele. Umoya oingwele. Uyinsebenzo katiko kuinto aitetileyo. Ukubanga ba unento ea tetuangu tiko. Noba kukwiminyaka emingapi ebo minibako. Impumelelo yayo. Ibeni umoya oinwele wehile na pezu kwako. Imibono onayo. Izikilelo onazo. Amanda a fulfillment. Ukuzali seki sa kwezo zinto. Kuku kuseque shelweni kwako umoyo inwene. A kuko sekubeni usenk onzwini eno moya o inwele. Kusek beni wena ukwe shele na. Kuya kutini na ukubakube ko o kukum dinga zani nam tunje. Uya kwe sa umoya o ingwele pizu kwako. Nali pina ili zwi awa pizu kwako. Nantoni na noba lili zwi ola mkele li shunya yelwa. Ukuze kwenze ke kuwe. Funeka kwe umoyo ingwele. Amanda ose nyangu ini agusibe kele. Ukuze kupume lonto. Ebu itetiwe nobu itenji siwe. Jengo basi itenje na umtu nga mnye uzalwa ene seed of greatness embilini ni waki. Ukuchwa ngutiko enento yobu kulu. Etu alise umshaba. Ubu kulu bako aibo basen konzwe. Ubu kulu bako aibo basen kaya. Ubu kulu bako aibo bunjalifa bako wenu. Ubu kulu bako aibo bobu khaten. Ubu kulu bako aibo bobu chwa. Ubu kulu bako aibo belali yako. Ubu kulu bako aibo ben konzwe yako. Ubu kulu bako aibo benda wa shalaku yo. Ubu kulu bako bodenda wa yonke utiko aizali sileyo. Utiko. Isi kwa nyuiso se shabat. Ustate wa sifaga embili nini wako. Ukuze ubu kulu bako bupume. The Holy Ghost shall come upon you. And the power of the highest shall overshadow. Then there shall come out of you a holy thing. That seed of greatness in you is a holy thing. In order for that holy thing to germinate and cover your world, the Holy Ghost shall come upon you. After the Holy Ghost has come upon you, there is the overshadowing of power of the harvest. Amanda Osenyangwini Akusibekele. The Holy Ghost comes upon you and lifts off of you. Then there is something that remains with you, and that thing is called the power of the highest. 
it overshadows you. You don't feel it, you don't see it, but the people outside you they see it and they feel it. They know it, they recognize it, and they say, God is with you. Okay. John chapter 6. John chapter 6, verse 57. As the living Father has sent me, and I live by the Father. Jengo kuba uba u opila yo. Kwa ye kem na yesu luteta. Di pila. Ngaye. Kaipini. As the living Father has sent me, and to me and I live by the Father so he that eateth me even he shall live by me Besite ti. Jengo bandi pila ngaye. Kukuti ni kupila ngaye. For it is not by bread alone that a man shall live. Umtu aga pili nge songa sodwa. But by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of the Lord. Upila nga mazwi onke. Apuma emlonye katiko. Now, lamazwi onke ukuze upile ngawo funeka uwaze emfa kukuba hile afiku moyo nyele abe nento ama kaifuka mele. E Bible ama gama o afundi leyo e Bible leni they remain in formation until the power of God, the power of resurrection, the power that gives life, give life to these words that are inside you and they become flesh. You shall lay hands on the sick and the sick shall recover. Then it is okay. Uyes ut agasonga umtu apilangas agunga songa sod agunga songa sod not agunga songa agunga sod it songa songa don. Sonkinyam. Ukubanga ba uti akunga sonka sotwa. Ikela into yokuba amaswi onke apumem lonye gatiko. Aya plenda u sonka siagus. Aya nyame. The words that I speak. Verse 63. John chapter 6, verse 63. It is the spirit that quickness. The flesh profited nothing. It is the spirit that quickened. Gumoya of Vusnya. 
kumoya ofufnya yes the flesh profited nothing inyama aizuzi into i no not aizuzi into aizuzi into ainikisini funeke uyikhungulele chapter uba isuka kwesa song uyesu ebe simultiply shile so xa esithi inyama aizuzi into uminisha into yokuba okuphuma enyameni akuzuzi into kodwa ekuphuma kumoya funda it is the spirit that quickness kumoya ovusayo the flesh profited nothing mm -hmm. the words that i speak unto Amazu you and what theta yokuni they are spirit angumoya angulo moya uvusa inyama ubune inyama ephicikayo yazi ubufuna amazwi kungamazwi onke aphumemlonyi asobe phumile what will happen you have to believe those words let it be unto me according to your word then the holy ghost shall come and the power of the highest shall overshadow you and that holy thing that shall be born of you shall be called the son of god eat the words and believe the words call upon god to fulfill the words then the power of the highest shall overshadow it shall hover upon it In the beginning was the word the word was with God and the word was God in him was life and life was the light of man Everything that was made was made by him Oh yes Hebrews 11 verse 1 By faith we understand that the worlds were framed by the word of God The worlds were framed by the word of God, we understand that. We stand under that knowledge. Bazalwan. Ah, we've been telling you, we've been telling you, we've been telling you, ukupa i voice of god izinto zonke ziyamamela kuxa kutheni kuxa amazwi am uye wawagcina waze wawenza mna noba usiza kwehla sakhikhaya silakhaphi ayi xa xa uye wawagcina amani amazwi asizanga uwe size emazwini asembilini wakho siyehla siyohlala emazwini ngoba and the spirit of god that upon the face of the funi umoya ingcela uzofuka hama ukuze uthi xa uthethe uthethe the thus saith the lord ngoba kuphuma embilini ni kathixo uthi kuphukamile ito and whatever that comes out of your mouth it is called the son of god the son of god is being birthed if the limbs are straightened it's because the son of god is being birthed if the eyes are opened the black eyes are opened the son of god is being birthed if the healings begin to happen in your ministry it's because the word is made flesh And the Holy Spirit shall come upon you. You need the coming of the Holy Spirit. And you need that coming of the Holy Spirit after you have gobbled the word of God. Be glad on us in this word. Exenufuga. Stress. Bad day. In you, you know, this is the day that the Lord has made. The Lord has made for what? The Lord has made it for you. This is your gift. God has given 
given you this day and this day you choose what will happen in this day because the power of the highest is within you you turn to the day you don't let the day decide for you early in the morning after the coming of the holy ghost you say day come here come here i'm going to work now come and sit down here i want to tell you i will be fulfilled in this day i will be successful in this day i will sit in this day every program that i planned for this day will come to pass and without stress it will be to edify me and the Holy Ghost and the Holy Ghost shall come upon you Basalwan in the bank you are saying that you are going to be a mini affig see you again a mini scar is this a possible It depends on the coming of the Holy Ghost upon your life. The Holy Ghost is God's answer to the question, How shall it be unto me? Zeus Zalisega Ganja and it tickles in those tetilay bominibam. Gagwe Shaumo Yingwell. At no man just a young without Sibegate. Is the it Lord? It tet alone to Usam ninety one. Ta a city. Hi, Uyolum. Oz Shalisayo. A city. The power of the highest shall overshadow you. Without the Holy Spirit, you will remain the normal Christian. Uzawamba i op tinjenga bantu bonk. Uzawambi clinic in Jenga Bantu Bonke. Go as the Father, as the living Father has sent me. I, Jesus, live by Him. I live by Him. And also you shall live by Him. Because you shall live by me. Eat in the land. Eat. 
ngoko timhlile ubawo wena uba uye wahlamna uyihlile iphoison ebendi ihlile you will say have the same effect in your life amen uzavanga le ndivanga hayi ngoba ipoison endi ityileyo isemalungwini am xa utye mna utye kwalo poison sizawufana ngoba nditye amazwi aphuma kubawo uthi nayo into endiyenzayo ndingabona ngubawe yenza amazwi endi wathetha akaphumi kumu why ndi wahlile ndimhle umtona la mazwi nake walika wahlamna ili into ebe ndihlile uyinto endiyo kodwa yihlaqala Lazalwa ubu Kristo ayonto inoma awamkele uYesu emva koko uhambe nje Ngoba ukwamkela uYesu kukususwa kwe history yakho Xa wawumkele uYesu kucinywa izolo lakho kodwa ukuze kubhalwe inamhlanje lakho and the holy ghost shall come upon you the power of the written word the word empowered by the coming of the holy ghost i man ka kangele first john chapter chapter 5 pa misa sani mtoti kumnandi nkonzweni mtoti kumnandi nyani Chapter 5 verse 4 First John chapter 5 verse 4 For whatsoever is born of God yonke into ezelwe nguthixo overcometh the world iyaloyisa ilizwe into etheni ezelwe nguthixo yonke into etheni ezelwe nguthixo iyathi iyaloyisa ihlabathi ibazalwana ingase ndithi khani ke nimfundi ujohn nimfundi evuliwe ngoba ujohn is acquainted with power in christ ujohn nguye yedwa othi lento esiyibonayo apha kuYesu lilizwe nje ngoba uYesu wazalwa nje wazalelwa ilizwe ukuze ahluke kwabanye abantwana wahlulwa lilizwe and uze umazi uYesu ukuba wafu efunda kulo omzeleyo ngoba lo wamzalayo funda kulo wayethunywe kuye waqala wanombuzi wathi ndiyayivinto ithetha yomhlekazi kodwa into enje enkulu kangaka ngamanye amazwi uthi imiracle yehla kanjani yathi ngilosi kuqale kufike eli lizwini kuxelela lona ze alo ulamkele usoku ulamkele ukuze liphumelele kuza kwehlumo yoyincwe xa kuchazwa ukuzalwa kwakhe chazelwa kuba wazalwa kanjani kuchazwa lo mhlola ukuba ukuthetha kukathixo kuzalisekiswa kukwehla kukamo yoyincwe wafunda lo nto kufikilizwe azimo yoyincwele lithi lisokwamkelwa alehlele ilizwe lilapha kuwe alifukame ukuze linchule wena ube lilizwe ebe lithethiwe kuwe eli linyama nje uyinyama libe inyama apha kum ndavuma lonto wehlumo yoyincwele xa 
ibulisana no cousin wam we shumo yo ingwele ye nobe sele ufelo ngumtuane siswini wafu kumtuana goba how shall it be unto me the holy ghost shall come the holy ghost is the answer to every situation in your life if you need resurrection of the dead things let the holy ghost come dead future let the holy ghost come dead ministry let the holy ghost come dead calling let the holy ghost come dead visions let the holy ghost come he will hover upon that dead thing in your life and it will come back to life shall come to the word that you have received akahambela yonke inyaka nyaka le uhambela uhambela ilizwi elikholiweyo where you submit under the authority of that word you say let it be i don't understand it but let it be unto me i don't i don't know how it, it will happen but the holy ghost shall come upon me let it be unto me let it be be stupid enough to say i don't understand but let it be i don't know how but i know god who knows how 